guess what? It's three degrees outside and I've got a chest cold, but you know what? I know that I need to work out and I'll feel better when I'm done. So we're going to. You know what we're here to do today? Of course you do because there was a title on this video. Chest, shoulders, back. That's the way it's going to go. We're going to try to keep it in this vicinity. Chest, shoulders, back is the workout today. We're doing full on Tabata okay. workout. So if you don't know what that is, that's a 20 second on, 10 seconds off. And you do that for eight rounds or four minutes. So you kind of think of it in 30 second intervals. You're going 20 seconds of work, whatever that exercise is, you do it 20 seconds and then rest for 10 seconds, do it for 20 seconds, rest for 10 seconds, and so on. So you're going to pick a light weight. Well, lighter, a little bit lighter than usual because you're going to be pretty sore if you're a girl. You're going to be pretty sore when you're done. Right. We're don't by any means. We're not trying to claim that we're professionals. Mm -mm. We're just telling you what we read and what we what we do. We just work our out at home. Right. Yeah. This is our experience. Uh, our experience is this: push as hard as you can push. And if you feel like you can't go with Tabata, it's only twenty seconds. You can do anything for twenty seconds. Just That's do body important. weight. Just do body weight. Just just keep pushing. You've got to push through it. That's what's going to make the changes. Okay. So what we have today, you've got floor flies. We're going to do that off of the bands. We're going to show you how to do that off of the bands. If you have any set of bands, even the ones that come from Walmart, you get a little uh, door, door mount, anchor. a door anchor, so you can put it in the door, and this is how you do flies. We're going to do one-arm floor flies with the bands, mm -hmm. uh, and then we've got a cardio in between each one. It's an active recovery. So active with the bands, recovery. we'll show you how to do it, but it's going to go one arm, you're going to go 20 seconds, we're going to do that for four rounds, and then we're going to switch arms and go 20 seconds, 20 on, 10 off, and you do that for four rounds. After that, we're going to do jumping jacks. You can get a picture of that if you want. Take a pause and look at it. We're going to go jumping jacks. So it's floor flies, jumping jacks. After ju after uh, jumping jacks, we go back to our uh, Tabata. T mm -hmm. Jumping jacks will just be one minute of jumping jacks. Then it's going to be uh, back to Tabata, and we're going to do um, uh, shoulder press. So that's just going to be stand on your band or get you a weight. You're going to press up. That's both hands at the same time. I was just holding this fancy board that we had. And technology here, we have lots of technology. So, <clears throat> and then uh, after that, we're going to do jump rope for one minute, and then we're going to go bent over rows, and that's going to be back to Tabata, and then our active recovery will be a plank for one minute. So that's the workout. Just a warning, I hate jump rope, and I hate jump rope inside even more, mm -hmm. so I'm probably going to go virtual. Uh, well, I am not, because I'm not a wimp. That's okay, I am. All right, I'm going to get you started on a little bit of a warm-up here. You do that while I'm After I the tip the camera up a little bit. Yeah, our camera guy called in today, so we're going to have to run the camera ourselves. Uh, so <laughs> we've just got it on. That's a joke. We don't have a camera guy. We are our own camera guy. All right, so take your arms, open them nice and wide like this. We're going to warm up those chest muscles right. a little bit. Whoop. Wow. No, like this, and then do some shoulder presses to kind of warm up those muscles. And I guess back to this, because we're warming up the back muscles. Get all of it nice and warm. Do some rotator cuff type things with your shoulders here. Lift your shoulders up and around. Some arm circles, front. Okay, I'm just going to show you guys this. When you have children and you have a jump rope, this is what you get, okay? Uh, our set guy didn't get everything set out for us. Yeah, our, our set guy didn't get everything set. Reverse your uh, arm circles. Back to arm swinging, like hugging yourself. I'm not above warming up. I was untangling my rope. And pulling out my rope, apparently, that he's trying to get me to use. No, I'm not. You guys just want to see me really mad. I'm just putting it there. I mean... Talk about making me mad, it's jump rope in the house. It hits my toes, even with my shoes on, my legs, oh, my arms. Honey, I was just putting it there in case, in case you wanted it, okay? All right, grab, grab your right arm, grab your right tricep, pull it across your body. Give yourself a stretch that way. We won't stay too long because we're before the workout. You don't want to make everything too, too limber before you work out. There you go. There we go. There we go, up tall. Oh. And down. Show my belly just a little, little <laughs> all the way down. <laughs> I touched my toes today. That's pretty good. <laughs> all right, that's it. We're calling that a workout. We're calling that a warm up. All right, so pointing it down. I'll show you real quick. 
you're going to grab your band. I've got it attached to the top of the door. Sit on your knees. And all you do is put your opposite hand on the floor. So in my case, I've got my right hand on the floor, left hand grabbing the band off of the door anchor, and I just simply pull one hand to the other hand. And that's going to that's gonna act as a fly across your pec, which is what you want. We're doing that for two full minutes on one side, and then we'll switch sides. Okay, so four sets of, the, of left, and then four sets of right. And for some reason, I didn't get any sound. Let me try that again. We need an egg timer. I just restart it. This one doesn't seem to have any sound going. Hmm, that's not good. Well, we're going without sound because I thought we had sound on it. We'll let you know when to stop. Just follow us. I guess. We'll have to just watch the timer. Let's see if I can make sound come on it. Background work, pause. <coughs> Keep screen on. It says it's supposed to have sounds. Do you have your volume up? I do. I have the volume mm -hmm. all the way up. Okay, maybe. Uh, it's got us a prepare round here, so you got a few seconds to. Oh, okay. Here we go. So we go in 11 seconds. Can you see that? You probably can't see that. No, I'm in the way. That's okay. Here we go. Four, three, there's the sound. So right. work. Now you don't, it doesn't matter how many, you just keep going. Keep your arm a little bit bent so that your hands don't scrape the floor, but you want them to kind of graze the floor a little bit. And you're working this muscle, oh, you can't see, no. underneath my shoulder here. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> You'll not think that later. Ten seconds is going to seem really short. Okay, round two. And if you're doing this and you're like, I don't want to stop, I just want to keep going, and you're, I could really up my weight a little bit, just slide away from your anchor just a little bit. Okay, that's starting to hurt a little. Okay. Take a second and kind of shake it out. Yeah, pull a Taylor Swift and shake it off. Maybe that's what we'll call this workout, shake it off. So we're not really shaking a whole lot. Breathe out as you press or pull your hand towards your other hand. It's important to make sure that you're breathing. The nice thing about Tabata is you don't have to count as long as you're just constantly working. I don't know about you, but I'm starting to really feel a burn. Right here. Oh, here we go. Last one on this side. Try not to grip your handle too tightly as you go to grab your handle to press it in. Ow! So right, glad that's over. around. All right, so I'm hurting like right in here. This time you put your left arm on the floor, your right arm's going to pull. Or if you're like me, your right arm in the floor and your left arm's going to pull towards your right hand and you're going to make sure that you breathe. Keep your tummy in tight. We always want to practice that. Now, you'll have to work off your door anchor. We have a pole in our basement, so I've made some straps to, to come off the pole. But a door works fine. If you can't do that, if you've only got dumbbells, lay on your back on the floor, put a dumbbell in one hand, and go the other way. Go like a traditional fly, just at one arm. Ooh. I promise you'll feel it, no matter what. Oh. Are you Working. doing this? Leave us a comment and tell us if you're actually doing this. Time to go. This is the round where it starts to really hurt. And then we have one more. By the way, this is my favorite chest exercise. Alright, you got one more guys. You can do it. 
We've made it this far. Seven rounds. This is eighth round. Let's Boing. do last round, best round. Two. I don't know why I'm counting. The habit. All right. Good job, guys. Jack Jack. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Go. All right, I gotta pause you. You're setting up a camera. Yep. There we go. All right, Take good to go. A little bit. Oh, I didn't want to get the light. No, but you're cutting that off. There you go. Okay. You're going, jumping jacks. All right. Do it to the tongue. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, it's a good stretch out for the chest. Oh. Again, we're not counting these. This is one minute, minute of jumping bobs. What? Jumping bob. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay. These could be jumping marks if you want. Instead of jumping jacks, funny. Okay. Did you oh. get it now? Yeah. Just took her a second. Uh, I thought it had something to do with the no arms, no legs. Does anybody know, did Jack actually invent the jumping jack? Or is it Jack's? Jumping jacks because of the game jacks. Where you have the little pieces. Oh, that looked like a little star. Yep, seven, six, four, seven. three. Two, one. Oh golly. Okay. Alright. That's some great active recovery, guys. Okay. Shoulder right. press. Get yourself a drink of water if you need it. I think I'm gonna regret this whole uh shoulder press. I'm gonna go with tens for each hand. What weight are you doing? I'm going to attempt 23 pounds in each hand. We oh, like a um, purple band. We like to use body elastics bands because they've got a cord inside to keep them from snapping. So uh, it's the brand body elastics. You can use any band you want. This particular band is 23 pounds per hand. So that's. Uh, Kind of equivalent to about a 20 pound dumbbell. Uh, depending on how you stand on. For me, I'm a tall person. I'm six foot. So when I stretch it, I've got a lot of stretch up top. So we're going to try to go same thing. It'll be 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. The only difference is this time you don't get to switch sides. So this is one muscle over and over and over. I don't know if I'm going to be able to keep going with this purple band. If I have to, I'll drop the weight. The other band's on the side. But. <clears throat> I'm going to try. I'm going to go with 10s. I didn't uh, grab any backup weight, so I'm just going to drop the weight if I have to. But I'm hoping I can stick with 20 seconds and just be good with that. Yeah, here we go. So, uh, you go in about 15 seconds. Oh, it gave us a countdown round. Nice. I'm glad you set that up. Yeah. All right. So we're going to try to make these strict military press, <clears throat> which means... We're not going to go like that to get it up, unless we absolutely have to. So, just straight up. Pick your weight up and put it up over your head. Four. Five. Try to keep your palms six, facing forward. Seven, Breathe out when you push up. So, and make sure to keep your core tight. In this exercise, you could really do some damage <clears throat> to your lower back. And also your shoulders. Be careful with shoulders. You don't want to hurt them. You don't. You can. Shoulders are a small muscle, which make them easy to hurt. So you got to be cautious with what you do. You'd rather err on the side of caution on this one. If you're worried about it, go down. Go down and wait. I'm about ready to have to go down and wait. Oh my golly, this is a whole lot harder than I thought. Woo! Two rounds. What's worse is I've done 12s before in shoulder presses, and I can barely do 10s right now. I don't know if it's because I'm sick, or because I haven't been in the habit of working out as much lately, or because these hurt. Keep pushing, keep going. Do not stop. I want to stop, I want to stop. Okay, one more. Oh. Whew. 
I'm gonna go one more round with this purple and I'm gonna have to go down. Okay. Four, three, two, one. This may not look like much, but that's if you're not doing it. If you're doing this, it hurts. Yep. Oh man. The whole point of this is that we want you to get up out of your desk chair or get up out of your bed, put your cell phone on the stand, cast it over your TV. Oh. <sighs> All right. And do this with us. Yeah. All right, I'm dropping. I'm just going to take one weight and do some sort of modified shoulder press like this. Because it's killing me. Oh. Still working the same muscle, just a little bit different. It's still burning on the top of my shoulder. Maybe that even more. Oh. Okay. You can feel your shoulders start to get warm oh. as you do this. Go. Oh. I'm taking just one dumbbell. I picked too heavy of a weight. Almost grabbed the fives out of the closet, but honestly, the closet is not very organized, and I didn't feel like digging for both of them. Whew. I don't even know what round this. You got two more rounds. Are you kidding me? Two more rounds. Oh my golly! All right, let's push to the end. It's only two more rounds. It's only two. Keep your core tight to support your lower back and push, push. If you can't drop your weight, you can push like this with your hips, standing in a split stance. Oh, gosh. All right, I'm going to go back to both tens for the last round. And I'm just not going to do a strict military press. I'm going to do a push press like this. Whew. Still working the same muscles, fully extending your arms at the top. <sighs> really? Just burn it out. Go until the timer. Whew. All right. That's it. No, you got it. One minute. Jump rope. A jump rope. <sighs> I'm doing virtual. She's doing virtual because she's a wimp. Uh huh. Go. A wimp. Okay. All right. Trying to give you room so you don't hit the ceiling. We've got a little bit of a low spot in the ceiling where there's an air duct. Okay. Honey, jump rope. <sighs> this isn't so bad though because I'm not in a lot of pain for whacking myself with the rope. Well, I've got a weighted jump rope, so I've got a few pounds in each hand. Helps the extra shoulder work if you've got a weighted jump rope. Keep going. In the spring when it warms up and it's not four outside, we might do a jump rope video outside. Okay. All right, we've got bent over rows next. Oh, ow, ow, ow. I'm gonna feel? regret this. Get you a water if you want a water. That's your moment to do it. These 12s. I can already tell. This was a bad choice. The good news is I've got my tens to drop to. So I'm gonna pull those a little bit closer to me. All right, now, let me talk with you real quick about back. I cannot do heavy pants or bent over rows every time I do. I mean, every time I throw my back out. So, there's certain ways that I can if I've got a straight bar, but I don't this morning. If I try to do dumbbells, it'll, it'll put me down for a day. So instead, I'm going to use bands, and I'm going to come off the door. So if you have to modify, my point in saying that is if you have to modify, if you've got some sort of condition that causes you to not be able to do it, you don't just stop working out. Pick a different, pick a different exercise. So Sarah's going to do a bent over row. She's going to be bent over and pulled this way. That hits my lower back way too hard. So we're targeting, we're not targeting the lower back with this exercise, we're targeting right here at the lat muscles. And so what you do with the band, attach it to your door about hip high, squat down, and then you just pull 
and now your back is nice and erect. And if you're having lower back issues, you won't throw your back out, but you still get to work your lat muscles. If you're going to do them like me, keep your stomach in tight to hold your back tight. And just row. Yeah. Pull straight up. Keep your arms down and just pull straight up behind you. Get your elbows up as high as you can. All right, that's it. You got 17 seconds to grab you a band, grab you a weight. You could also do it with the straight bar, which I can do it with the straight bar. I hurt my back. You just bend over and pull up your thighs. Here we go. Keep your butt out if you've got weights. And keep your core in tight. You really want to keep that back supported. Breathe out when you pull in towards your chest. Work until the bell. Gosh. You want to make sure you get in as much work as possible. It's only 20 seconds of work. I've got, if you're wondering, I've got about 50 pounds per hand. I've got a 23 pound band and a 30 pound band. I only have 12 pounds per hand. And you know what? I'm about ready to only have 10. It's supposed to burn. Oh, all right. One more. Do one more with 12s. One more. Come on. I couldn't do that round. Come on, do it. One more. Pull. You should be grunting a little bit. You should get kicked out of Planet Fitness. I gotta swing the weights to get them up. Ah. Uh, that's the, uh, that is the beauty of bands. You cannot swing them. You've got to pull. You can't use any inertia to get them up. Or to oh, get them back. my golly. These tens are killing me. Oh, man. Pull. Do it. You at home, pull. Pull your hands into your chest. That's all you're doing. So Halfway good. there. Halfway there. Two more minutes. I'm dying. I'm, I'm regretting this weight. I wish I'd picked it at a lighter weight. Do one more before you go down. I can't go down. You got fives in there. I can't get them out. They're very. Tell us how much weight you're doing in the comments. We want to know. We want to get to know you, but we can't if you don't leave a comment. So, yeah. do this with us. Leave a comment. Okay. Round six. The one thing about Tabata is when you're pulling the same muscle or pushing the same muscle over and over, it's really taxing. Yeah. Oh gosh. Oh, I'm moving to a split stance to help support my lower back a little bit more. Whew, because I feel it lighten up a little bit from bending over like this. Get your shoulders, your shoulder blades, try to get them together. Try to squeeze them together. I cannot believe you have not dropped that purple yet. Ooh. One more round. All right, this is our last round. Make it your best round before we do a minute of plank. Pull as hard as you can pull. Dig deep. Make it sweat. Unless it's four degrees where you're at and you ain't sweating no matter what. It's not four degrees down here. It's like 62. Yeah, but this will get rid of the flap under your arms when you're wearing a dress. Yes, it will. When you're wearing a spaghetti strap shirt. All right, plank time. You want to borrow this? Yeah. For your sure. elbows? Go ahead. I'm going to point oh, it down. You know what? Down. I'm going to pause it. Uh, no, wait. Yes, I am. Okay. Oh, uh, no. I'm not going to pause it. Just go. Here we go. I, uh. I finally got it to pause. <laughs> Oops. Coordination is not her strong suit. All right. All right. Keep your butt down. Elbows on the ground. Straight ahead. 
if this is too hard for you and you can't do it, go to your knees like this. If you're in this and you're like, oh my god, I'm going to die, kind of stick your bottom up just a little bit for a little bit of a rest or drop to one knee for a little while, like five seconds and try to get back into it. The longer you hold it, the better it is. You want to suck your tummy in and get your stomach. Think about pulling your belly button into your spine. As much as you can, suck every bit of that fat and goop up into your belly. All your holiday Christmas treats. Stay there. Ah. We're going a full minute. We missed 12 seconds. Almost there. Rock forward just Three, a little bit over your hands. Two. One. Oh, and that's a wrap. Oh. Wow. All right, I gotta give Mabs a little bit of break. I'm gonna go down to child's pose to start the stretch. Oh, that feels good on the backs of my arms where that was hurting for my shoulders. And back exercises. I'm grabbing out as far as I can and I'm walking my fingertips out to try to pull as much as I can. Whew. All right, you want to go into Cobra? Sure. All right, lay down on your stomach. Put your hands underneath your shoulders. Push straight up and try to keep your shoulders down. All right, so that was chest. I think this is Cobra. Yeah, it's Cobra. That was chest, shoulders, and back. We did a full Tabata for each with a little bit of cardio in between. Hopefully you enjoyed that. Leave us a comment. Tell us what you think. Don't forget to hit subscribe. We're uploading at least two videos a week uh, of exercise. So that's all this channel is. Oh, let me bump this up a little. You're not going to get... You like the way I walked on my knees like that? Was that impressive? I don't know. I've got lots of skills, lots of traits. Uh, but this channel is nothing but working out. That's what it is. We're working out at home. We want you to work out with us. Uh, the point of b being at home... For us, children are upstairs. They're just getting out of bed. It's early in the morning. We're not having to use other people's sweaty equipment. We don't have to leave the house to go do this. We like going to gyms, but, but honestly, we don't have time in our lives for it. And the point of this channel is to say, if, even if you feel like you don't have time, you do. You can cut, we are physically in our basement working out with the equipment that we have, whether that's bands or dumbbells, and you can do the same. We're trying to encourage you to get up off the couch and work out. We work out at home. You can work out at home. You can work out with us. If you don't know, if you say I don't know what to do, come work out with us, and uh, you'll find out. We got lots of stuff coming in the future. It's all working out though. That's, that's what we're doing. We're working out at home. Yep. Got anything to say? She's get got... up and work out. Yeah. Work out. <clears throat> uh, work out. <laughs> okay, we're going. <laughs>